Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google Account Lock security feature on an Android device, also known as the FRP Lock for Factory Reset Protection. Now, here with us today, we have a Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 FE, which stands for Fan Edition, and this device does indeed have the Google Account Lock enabled because, as we can see here, as we're going through the setup steps, we get to the screen that tells us that the device was reset, and to continue, we have to either verify the previous security screen pin lock that was used, or if we tap on Use My Google Account instead, this might be easier to see this way. It'll also give us the secondary option to sign in with a Google account that was previously used on the device. And so we've been contacted by tons of customers over the years asking us for assistance with this specific issue on this specific model, usually either because they themselves accidentally got locked out of their own device and couldn't remember or recover their login information after having done a factory reset, or because they purchased the device used from a dishonest seller who didn't tell them that the device was locked. At any rate, we're now making this video here to show any interested customers that we do offer a service to be able to get the lock removed from this exact model without having to have the previous user's login info. It's something that we do directly to the device while it's plugged into a computer, and the great thing about this is that it's something that can be done for just about anyone anywhere in the world. So you don't necessarily need to be located here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you. You just need to have a decently powerful Windows computer along with a fast internet connection, and we can remotely connect right to your computer through the internet to perform the exact same procedure that we did here with this one. So actually, before starting the video, we had already done 99% of the work necessary to remove the lock. We just left it in place as the last step so that you guys could actually see that it was indeed locked, that this is real and valid, that we can actually do this, that we're not you know, sneakily signing into our own account or any other trickery like that. So the last step of the process here, like I said, is just to restart the device once, and then when it boots back up, we should be able to see that we can get all the way through the setup steps without running into that Google lock screen. All right, we are fully booted up here, so we're going to go ahead and begin going through everything. First is reading and agreeing to Samsung's terms and conditions. And then it'll ask us about Wi-Fi, which we actually don't need, so I'm just going to turn that off and skip it. We don't need to copy any apps and data. There's talking all about the various Google services. We don't need a screen lock, so we're going to skip that step. We don't need a Samsung account either. There's more about Samsung services, and now it says we're all set up. So when we tap on finish, we should be able to see that, yep, we've got the home screen loaded up here. We have full access to all of the apps and settings and features, and this is just like a brand new device that never had the lock on there. While we're here, I'm going to go ahead and pop into the settings really quick just to show you exactly what we're working with. So when we go under About Tablet, we can indeed see that we have a Galaxy Tab S7 FE, and then that model number there, the SMT733. That's the model number of this specific device that we're working with here. So, if you have one of these Tab S7 FEs and need help getting the Google Lock removed from it, we would love to assist you with that, so go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact info will be posted right down in the video description, and we'll also put a slide at the end of the video here that has all of our info there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have here on our channel, as we offer a lot of different services for thousands of models of mobile devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy someday.
Hitting that subscribe button while you're there will enable you to be notified of all of the new videos and services that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like we're doing here with this one. Y para todos ustedes hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes también nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks so much for watching, everyone, and have a great rest of your day.